Well, um, <laughs> staying in the in the rap lane, did you hear that the rapper um, Mozzie had a concert and seven people were shot? Um, and this was involving people from his entourage, so he got arrested, actually, even though he didn't have nothing to do with the situation. It was his uh, people, allegedly, that, Get another that were involved. Please me. Um, I brought this up because um, they detained him and they arrested his friend. But is there a thing as too much entourage? Because then something like this happens and now he has to be arrested and take the heat. Well, first of all, I want to be uh, a very transparent by saying that I'll fuck with Mozzie 100%. Count to him. Shout out to him. So, you know what I'm saying? Our opinion is based on fact. I'm just going to base it on the fact that Mozzie's a good nigga. From all my encounters with him, all our conversations and shit like that. You know what I'm saying? And then, we got to remember, Mozzie, Mozzie's on game time. He's from Sacramento or somewhere out, out there. The and side. Yeah, and, and they come on game time. So when you got a regular nigga from the hood going to have entourage, I think in the gang is definitely going to have entourage. You know what I'm saying? So I don't think it's right, unlikely for people. Shit, seven people that, he probably had more than that. But shit, when we roll around, we might have... Depending on where we at, you know, we like to ride drop top, us, maybe security, kids chilling. But when we out of town, Mickey, you know how it go. It could quickly be seven to ten people. But um, I don't think that's nothing to, uh, against against him. It's just they got to detain everybody in it. I don't know the particular details on that. So shout yeah, out to Mozzie. Free him. I, he, he should be free by now. Well, like, they did let him go. Yeah, he, he got dumb money. He didn't have anything to do with it. But, um... Yeah, it's just a case of, again, you just, you know, bringing all your people along with you on your journey to success. And everybody can are, make you know? it. That's how I feel. Sometimes, something. sometimes shit happens. You, you know? think there's some point in a career that you should be looking for professional security and not just your homies? Absolutely. Well, absolutely. But you got professional security and you got a homie. Like, some of be around, if somebody violate, they dead on knocking the out for me. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. And then we got armed security. They, they got to kill something, they'll kill them. You know what I'm saying? Like, sometimes we just don't want no threats and no problems. So, you know, um, I don't know. That's kind of hard. Shit, I, I ran into IC the other day, and he had a bunch of people with him. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to IC. He dropped some quick juke gems on me. Shout out to Marco, too, man. And Marco was in a, a spot that we won't say because we don't want you fucking ghetto niggas filling it up. There. Yeah, we don't want y'all there <laughs> getting the views and, 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 and enjoying and taking Instagram posts. We don't want none of that. Okay, on to the next. Um, Damn it, can we go to shoot the commercial, Josh Hammonds? Let's, let's, let's take a commercial. Josh Hammonds, commercial. This yeah, nigga sleep again. We commercial, we we'll got, be right back. We gotta, oh, okay. My boy Jay got wake up. Man.